I recently took a trip to Puerto Rico with a couple friends. We had an amazing time out there. It's definitely a place that I will for sure be going back to. All the people were amazing. The food was fire, bro. The the mofongo, las empanadillas, and my favorite, bro, my favorite, la tripleta. Oh boy, that shit is fire af. Um, but I thought I'd I'd take advantage of this moment, and in this video, I'll be talking about the most wanted man in Puerto Rico, Adam. Jorge Beniquez was a big time criminal, murderer, and serial killer. If you were to Google first serial killer in Puerto Rico, his name is the first to appear. Beniquez's first known murder happened February 15th, 1990, when he shot and killed a man in Puerto Rico. His next murders wouldn't be until September 6th, 1990, when he stole a car in Carolina, which then started a police pursuit. Even though Beniquez was the one being chased, he managed to ambush both of the police officers shooting them down like bro that's that's crazy this guy was the one being hunted but did a full 180 and became the hunter crazy man sometime in november benny guess made the 35 minute flight or the two hour boat ride to st thomas u.s virgin islands on november 15th benny Kiss killed three people in a car in st thomas i couldn't find any reports that said why he killed them maybe some sort of altercation or something um but Be Benny Guest fits the definition of a serial killer 100%. Killing, taking significant amount of time in between each of them, and just doing it all over again. On January 10th, 1991, the following year, Benny Guest invited 23-year-old Daniel Valentin to his apartment in Bushwick. Bushwick is a borough in Brooklyn. Uh, but anyways, he invited him over, possibly trying to make like a drug deal or something. Then out of nowhere, Benny Guest takes his gun, shoots, and kills Valentin. This guy was nuts, bro. I do want to point out, point this out though, uh, this guy traveled a bunch, and for him not to get caught is insane, but then again, it was 1991. Nowadays, they strip you naked at TSA, so, you know, they ain't letting nothing slide anymore. Just 17 days later, on January 27th, he was in the Virgin Islands again, more specifically, St. Croix. In St. Croix, Benicas got into an altercation with two men that led into a shootout. A 22-year-old officer named Dexter Martinborough responded to the scene and a foot chase ensued between him and Beniquez. Martinborough chased and chased, and when he turned a corner, Beniquez was already aiming his gun for Martinborough's head. Beniquez shot Martinborough in the head, killing the officer. A month later, in February, Beniquez and his 20-year-old friend Carlos Madrid attempted to rob a jewelry store in Bushwick's Knickerbocker Avenue. During the robbery, the store manager, 29-year-old Luis Medina, was shot three times, killing him. Benicas in Madrid stuffed his body in a closet in the back of the store. After receiving tips from the Puerto Rican authorities about Benicas' whereabouts, Brooklyn detectives began searching for him. Benicas was arrested in Brooklyn at a grocery store on February 23, 1991. He had a 9mm Uzi with a 30 round clip on him. Adam Jorge Benicas was only 23 years old at the time of his arrest and he's responsible for at least 8 deaths. According to Puerto Rican police detective Jose Rodriguez, he had become the most wanted man in Puerto Rico. Benicas was charged with second degree murder robbery and criminal possession of a weapon although he wasn't charged with the murder of luis medina medina was the uh the manager at the jewelry shop uh benicas was convicted of murder uh because of daniel valentin the friend in which he invited over um in which they were possibly planning a drug deal um and he was sentenced to 25 years to life on april 7th 1992 so he's gonna be in there for a while he's been in there for a while already um, he's probably like 52 years old right now, 51, 52. And I mean, that's one more bad dude off the streets. I mean, it's been way before I was born, 1991. Uh, but yeah, he, he's been off the streets. But yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. Y'all are awesome. If you guys ever want to go to Puerto Rico, just do it. It's awesome. It's amazing. Uh, it's, you're, you're going to have a fun time, especially with the group of friends. Even if you want to just travel anywhere, dude, just do it. Life is way too short to just be fucking not doing shit. You know what I'm saying? YOLO, literally. You, you only live once. Just fucking do it. Um, if you guys want to see more of my trip, kind of like a vlog type of style, I'll probably post it on my other channel. I just posted some clips here from my trip. But um, if you guys want to see more, check out my other channel. I'll be posting another video on that channel shortly too. Probably some UFC fights. Uh, but yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are the best. Thank you. Stay safe. Um...
Peace out.